Thanks FlexSeal for sponsoring this video and powering our science mission. Hi, I'm Mark from Team Dominator. I have a TV lap tray that's seen better days. The surface is peeling, the stuffing's fallen out, and the frame needs repair. Using the Flex products I have on hand, I'm going to repair and upgrade it. First, I start removing the staples which are holding the main board in. Then I remove the material that holds the beads. I'm using flex glue to repair the frame and flex tape to hold it while it's setting. Always use a sharp knife or razor blade when cutting flex tape as scissors will gum up. Flex Glue Mini is ideal for small jobs like this. I'm using the Flex Glue to glue the frame together and to fill in the voids. I add a bit of flex tape to give the joints support whilst drying. Giving the frame a new paint job with flex seal colours. First I sand the frame so flex seal adheres. Then I add masking tape where I don't want the flex seal to go. Shake the can vigorously. Pro tip for any spray can with a dot, line up the nozzle with the dot so you can get at all the contents. I spray the rear of the frame in long even strokes about 8 to 12 inches out. Then I clear the nozzle by inverting the can and spraying till clear. After leaving to dry for 24 hours, I spray the front. Because the surface is so badly damaged, I cut a new piece of MDF. I'm using some adhesive vinyl I have on hand to create a black background. Trimming off the excess with a selection of storm chasing photos. I'm using masking tape to mark the location and double sided tape to stick the photo down. Finally, I use transparent contact sheet to give protection to everything. I'm using Flex Glue Transparent to glue in the board. This is an electronic corking gun, which I find makes all corking a lot smoother. I put the board in and press down to activate the instant grab of the flex glue. Then I fill in the remaining gap with flex glue. I got some expert assistance to sew the fabric to hold the beads. Then using flex glue again, I attach the fabric to the back of the board. After leaving 24 hours to dry, I filled up the fabric pocket with polystyrene beads. And it was sewn up. A design flaw of the original was that spills would leak around the edge. So I masked off the area and applied some flex shot. Job done, better than original, time to watch some TV. That's a stove pipe! Thank you for watching. Flex on.